Good morning. How's everyone doing on this beautiful Wednesday that we don't have any class at all? Yes. First and foremost, I would like to say thank you to IVC Foundation, faculty, staff, guests, and fellow scholarship recipients. And last but not least, the amazing donors with whom this would not be possible. Your stories, our stories, and my story would not be possible. So let me start with mine. I'm finishing up my third year here at IVC as a biological sciences major and will transfer in the fall. I was born and raised in Vietnam until my family moved to the US about five years ago. We decided to move so I could receive a better education and better opportunities to pursue my dream of becoming a doctor. We knew it would be a difficult and challenging journey starting a new life in a different country with new cultures and traditions. So, with my limited English, I submerged myself into American culture by watching Hannah Montana, <laughs> The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody, and High School Musical, where Zac Efron enunciates perfect English. <laughs> sure, I struggled a lot during the first few weeks of my junior year of high school, it was really hard understanding what my teachers and classmates were talking about. You see, in Vietnam, I had like two hours a week to learn English, and trust me, their accents were a lot different from what I was used to hearing. But that did not bring me down. I would go to school early and stay after to ask for help from my teachers and my friends. I would stay up late to do homework and prepare for the next day's lecture. In the end, my hard work paid off. I not only got good grades, but I also gained trust and respect from my teachers and friends to be elected as president of two clubs of my high school. At the end of my senior year of high school, I got the news that I was accepted to UC Berkeley. Thank you. And I started to research and ultimately found detriments with going to Cal and benefits with going to a local community college. So, Who's got two thumbs and chose Irvine Valley College over Berkeley? This girl. I know, I know. Who would reject Berkeley to go to community college, right? But I have never once regretted that decision. Through every semester, every class, and every opportunity I've come across, I am more certain that I made the right decision. If I had gone to Berkeley, I wouldn't have experienced all these leadership opportunities of being involved with Associated Student Government, Circle K International Club President, an Elevate Peer Mentor, and Honors Program Ambassador. If I hadn't chosen IVC, I wouldn't have been able to establish meaningful relationships with my professors, classmates, and program directors. I wouldn't have benefited from the warm engagement of a smaller class size compared to the chilling effect of a large lecture hall. And if I hadn't spent my time here at IVC, I wouldn't have been exposed to all these amazing scholarship opportunities, and I wouldn't be here today sharing my story. So yes, I know I made the right choice, and I appreciate and value every single second and opportunity I've had ever since I started school here at IVC. IVC shaped me to be the person that I am today. Before I end, I have one last thought that I want to share. As I stand in front of all of you today, I'm truly in awe of the donors who are here. Every one of them invested in us and in our futures. While receiving a scholarship can make anyone feel special, I can only imagine how it feels to give one. I hope that one day I am able to have the experience of awarding a scholarship to another promising IVC student. And I hope that all of you may one day do the same. Thank you again to everyone who made today possible. Thank you for giving me this opportunity to share my star story. And thank you, Irvine Valley College. Pew, pew, go Lasers. <laughs>